guys welcome back to what's cooking wednesday on big john tv today's recipe is for your slow cooker super easy mississippi pot roast i've seen this on the internet everybody goes crazy for it it's a big hit in my family in addition to that we're going to be making honey balsamic roasted carrots those are really quick only about 20 minutes in the oven so let's get going i'll show you how to put it all together all right we're going to start off with three pounds of chuck roast I had to buy two chunks because they didn't have one that was three pounds. I'm using my Instant Pot today as my slow cooker. Next, we're gonna combine 12 ounces of pepperoncinis and juice. You can use one packet of ranch powder or three tablespoons of the pre-made mix I showed you how to make. I'll link the video up above where I showed you how to make this ranch powder. And our last ingredient is one packet of au jus mix. Give this a quick stir. Pour this mix over your chuck. Spread your peppers out just a little bit. And that is it for prep work. I love that my Instant Pot can be for quick cooking and for long, slow cooking. Let's put the lid on and get this going. All right, we're gonna set it to slow cook. Up the time to eight hours and let it get going. See you back here in eight hours. All right, for our carrots, we're starting off with two tablespoons of balsamic vinegar. To that, we're gonna add two tablespoons of honey. Give that a nice stir, get all the honey all incorporated. Once that's all mixed together, we're gonna pour this over one pound of baby carrots. Give them just a quick toss, try and make sure all the carrots get some of that lovely glaze on them. A light sprinkle of black pepper. And these will go in the oven at 400 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes. All right, let's check on our Mississippi pot roast. Oh, that smells fantastic. You can see that this meat is just pulling apart. We're gonna take our forks and just shred it up. Leave it in all that yummy juice. All right, let's go ahead and build a sandwich while our carrots finish up in the oven. Give a nice smear of some mayonnaise. I'm gonna add just a little bit of sharp cheddar. And the best part, loading up with this beef. That looks fantastic. All right, our carrots are done. You can see that all that honey on balsamic has thickened up and created a nice, sweet, sticky, slightly tart glaze on these carrots. They're going to be delicious. Let's plate them up and get tasting. All right. Time to taste. It's about time I show up. <laughs> I'm going to the carrot first. I love raw or cooked carrots. They still have a slight crunch to them, so they're not totally mushy. Mm -hmm. Sweet and tangy. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Is that pepper on there too? There's a slight amount of black pepper. That's good. 
the balsamic nice, and honey. Nice little little bit, you know. Mm -hmm. That's good. It really breaks that up. Mm -hmm. Delicious. One out of two of my kids will probably eat this. Um, yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's move on to the sandwich. I cut it in half. You get a half a sandwich. Well, thanks. You can have another one. I'll still yours as soon as we're done. Probably. All right. So if you like very messy sandwiches, you could get a cup of the juice mm -hmm. left over from this and you can dip au juice out <laughs> as I throw meat on myself. Yeah, this isn't even a stand up and bite. This is a sit no. down and bite. I love these things. Mm -hmm. That was a great bite. That meat is super tender. The pepperoncinis have a nice kick, a little bit of a spice, but not bad. No more to me than say black pepper. It's about that level. I would agree. So if you're not a fan of spice, don't be afraid of pepperoncinis, especially right. in this application. When it cooks for this long time, it really mellows them out. Yep. Yeah, that, that meat is super tender. I love that little bit of a vinegary, vinegary bite like we were saying. Mm -hmm. That's so Excellent, good. can't so be good. beat, so easy. Yep. Set it and forget it. Yep. I love slow cooking. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you've done all the things. Like, subscribe, share yep. with friends. Please and thank you. And we'll catch you on the next one. All right. Bye. See you guys.